Hi guys, Futex here, back with another video, and in today's video guys, it is the final of the 2020 World Cup, guys, so yeah, I'm doing this mini World Cup once again on my channel, and yes, it is the final, finally, we've got the final guys, um, and it's from the collection of the Road to 2018 FIFA Russia World Cup packs, and obviously I'm going to be opening all five today, um, for the final like I always do so yes we'll, we'll find out today who will win my mini world cup so last time when I did this world cup series a few months ago in the same collection Wales won they had um, Sweden in the final Wales won 4-2 um, and we did actually have a confirmation of one result last game in the semi-finals it was um, Switzerland won Turkey nil so Switzerland are in the final of the world cup but who will they be playing Will it be Denmark or Argentina? Because they both played each other in the semi-final, these two countries. And it, they drew 4-4. What a game. The best game I've probably ever had in any of these tournaments. 4-4. And I put a poll up in the community tab. Who you want to see through. And it's a convincing winner. One out of 75%. The other one out of 25%. Um, and the winner was... Argentina guys so it's Switzerland Argentina in the final of the 2020 World Cup and commiserations for Denmark who will be finishing third this year but they did superbly so um yeah Switzerland Argentina um let's see who's gonna win the World Cup final let's get straight into them so excited guys right guys so here's the pack hopefully Messi can score for Argentina today um, and there are the odds. We don't really care about this, but there we are, guys. So, yeah, without further ado, let's get straight into it. Switzerland, Argentina. Leave in the comment section down below who do you think is going to win. My bet's on Argentina, as, of course, they're the stronger country and st stronger side. But you never know. Switzerland could get a brilliant win to win the first ever World Cup, I do believe. So, yeah, let's get straight into the first packet. Here we go. I don't want to show any of the cards. and make it a good suspense, guys. You can see me opening the pack. Let me just throw out the shinies. Because they probably um, turn around. Uh, in this pack, they're actually not. In fact, they're actually not turned around this pack. So that's all right. So let's get straight into the first card. Switzerland against Argentina. The final of the 2020 World Cup. Let's see, guys. So, oh, wait. They all stuck together. So the first card, we do have Wales. And it is of Andy King. There, but obviously no goal. Next up, we do have the Russian. Um, Fedor... Kudrashov, they're the defender. I'm not sure how to pronounce his name. Look at that haircut, like a mini mohawk. Very, very nice. <laughs> Next up, guys, no goal so far in the first packet. We have a first shiny, and it's another Russian player. Goal machine card of Kokorin. Very, very nice. But once again, no goals. Carrying on with this pack, we do have Sergio Ramos from Spain. Obviously, they got knocked out against Argentina in the quarterfinals. Uh, Spain went 1-0 up and lost 2-1 late on. Funes Mori bullet header in the 88th minute. Next up, we do have Denmark's Simon Kier here. They could have scored in the final if you guys voted for them. Very, very unlucky there. But once again, no goal there. Next up, very tight encounter so far in the first 20 minutes. We do have the Australian of Trent Sainsbury's here. No, well, Sainsbury, very, very nice. Sainsbury's, of course, a shop in England. <laughs> and the last two cards of this pack, we do have the Turkish player of... Um, Irkin here, obviously got to the semi-finals, but obviously no goal. And last but not least, we do have, oh, we've got two cards here. Well, we've seen the first one. You've got Callum Patterson of Scotland, which obviously is no goal. And the last card is Rising Star of Joshua Kimmich from Germany, the best defender this year award or something, didn't he get? I think so, I'm not 100% sure. But first pack, no goals in this tight encounter for the final of the World Cup. So yeah, we'll put the cards over there. And yes, let's get straight into the second packet. So tight so far. Let's see what we can get in there. These are my last packs of this collection as well, guys. So there won't be another one of these World Cups for some time. Um, yeah, until I get another booster box. You probably saw the name at the front there, but obviously it's... Um, or well, does it look like it's one of the countries we need? So I might as well put that. I might as well put that um, at at the start here. 
we put that at the start because you guys probably saw it. It's the um, Northern Ireland player, Oliver Norwood, of course, for Sheffield United for the first card in this next packet. Obviously, no goal. Next up, we do have... Oh, England's Eric Dyer. Very, very nice from obviously Spurs in England. Obviously, he went for a number two in a game against um, Chelsea, which we won, which was very, very nice. I am a Spurs fan. Next up, we do have... And Argentina grabbed the first goal of the World Cup final. And it's Lucas Biglia, the centre defensive mid, who um, gets Argentina's first goal of the game and his first goal of the tournament. So, one new Argentina. And, yes, finally, there's a breakthrough in the... We'll say the 25th minute or something like that, guys. I'm trying to go off by the packs. But yeah, one new Argentina. Great start for them. Switzerland need to bounce back quickly. Next up, we do have uh, Marco Rojas of New Zealand. Next up, we do have... Oh, I thought I switched in there. Andre Gomez from Portugal. Very nice. And um, obviously, plays Everton now. Next, we do have Fagner here of uh, Brazil. Nice. I'm not sure who he actually is. Looks like he's their right back in the um, World Cup. Next, we do have... And Argentina go 2-0 up. And it's the goal machine card of Gonzalo Higuain. And I think that might be his second or third goal of this um, World Cup, which would put him to a goal scorer if he has scored three in this World Cup tournament. But yes, guys, 2-0 Argentina. And it's looking miserable for Switzerland. They better bounce back quickly. They better get a card um, surely or soon enough. Next up, we do have another New Zealand player, and it's Chris Wood, fans' favourite card. Very, very nice. Of course, plays for Burnley. And last but not least, has to be Switzerland. We do have, no, it's Courtois from Belgium there. So, looking very bleak now for the Switzerland country, and there's fans, of course, and the players. But um, if you were Switzerland, it's a bit like Croatia, you'd be so happy to get to the World Cup, wouldn't you? Let's be real. But Argentina, the last... Big team, pretty much, um, left, really, with Spain. But obviously, it knocked out Spain. So, um, yeah, that's, that's good on them, I guess. So, yes, let's get straight into this next packet. As you can see, I am opening the pack. I just don't want to show you the cards. And I don't want to see the cards either. So, there we are. So, we just uh, sort the base cards out. Um, there we are. And the shinies, I should say. So, without looking at any of the shinies, which was good there. So first up, we do have in this third packet, Switzerland need a goal, and they don't start off with a goal. It is Stecklenburg, the goalkeeper from Netherlands. Very, very nice. Uh, nice card that is. Of course, uh, I think he's a bench for Everton now. De veteran. Uh, next up, we do have the Wales goalkeeper this time, and it's Wayne Hennessy, of course, the backup for Palace. So two backup goalkeepers. Next up, I think it's coming up to half-time in a minute. Yeah, once it gets to that card, it's half-time. As we say, this card is half-time. Next up, we do have... And it's Sweden's uh, defender, Lustig here. Nice, but no goals once again. And can anyone grab a goal just for half-time in, in added time? No, but Cristiano Ronaldo for the card there from Portugal. Very, very nice. So, yes, guys, it is half-time, and it's 2-0 Argentina. Let's get, carry on with the same packet. But, yeah, 2-0 Argentina. They have to bounce back quickly, Switzerland. Next up, we do have an Argentina grab their next goal, and it's 3 0 Argentina. It's Javier Mascherano here. Wow. 3 0 to Argentina in, I would say, probably the 50th minute, maybe. Maybe the 48th minute. I'm not too sure. But now, this is game over, surely. But look what happened last game 4 4 Denmark, Argentina. You can never write these cards off. Next up, we do have. Immobile goal machine from Italy. Very nice. Great striker he is. Carrying on with his pack, we do have the Colombian goalkeeper, David Ospina, fan's favourite. Obviously plays in Napoli now. Former Arsenal. Next, we do have the Italian of Parolo here. The veteran midfielder. And last but not least, we do have Jeff Hendrick, rising star from Ireland, of course. Has just joined Newcastle from Burnley. And he started very well with an absolute rocket of a goal. But yes, 3-0 to Argentina. This looks like it's game over. The last two packs now, the penultimate pack. Here we go, guys. Switzerland need goals. They need goals. Can they get any goals? We'll soon find out. So we switch the Chinese over and let's get straight into this. So, 
First up, we do have Spain's Vitolo here. So, yeah, no good for Switzerland, of course, or this game. Next up, we do have Raul Jimenez of Mexico. Very, very nice. Obviously, plays the Wolves. Next, we do have another Italian. It's Candrevo. We've got so many Italians in this, in this pack open. It's actually ridiculous. Very, very nice card, though. Next up, we do have... And Argentina make it 4-0. And it's Nicolas Otamendi with the bullet header again. Of course, just joined Benfica with the Ruben Diaz deal. It's 4-0 and it's game over. Two midfielders, one striker, one defender with the goal. And it's game over. Argentina are going to be the 2020 World Cup winners. Next up, we do have the Spanish player of Isco. Very, very nice card. Those are Spanish today as well. Carrying on with this pack, we do have... The defensive rock, very, very nice card. Don't get many of these. Of Victor Lindelof, of course, of Manchester United and Sweden. Very nice. Carrying on, we do have... Oh, very nice. No goals, but it's a top player card. I think this might be my first one of this booster box. And it's Antoine Griezmann from France. Top player. Look at that for a design. Um... There, one in 33 packs, and there's five of them. I'm not sure what ones I actually have, if I actually have any. But what a card. Imagine if that was the, um, if France win this final. Look at that, that's beautiful. What a lovely card that is. Top player for France there. Superb card. Let's put that up there. It's wonderful looking. I'm really happy about that, even though it's nothing to do with the scoreline. Next up, we do have... Elek here of Hungary, and last but not least, we do have the Scottish of Darren Fletcher. Very nice. <laughs> Good to see him in the uh, collection. I think he's retired now. And now into the last packet. It's game over. Any constellations for Switzerland or more routes for um, Argentina to Switzerland? We'll soon find out. It's the last packet, so uh, yeah. Here we go. Right, so, into this next packet, last pack. Any constellations? Probably not. So first up, we do have the Romanian of Kesaru here. No goal, <laughs> of course. Next up, we do have the Swedish player of um, Hildjamark. Very nice. Carrying on with this pack, we do have it stuck together. It's Topal here of Turkey. Nice. Carrying on, we do have... Oh, I thought that was Switzerland. It's Denmark again, and it's Hoybier. Of course, just joined Tottenham a few weeks ago or a month ago. Very, very nice uh, sign and, and card and player, of course. Obviously from Southampton. Next up, we do have Denmark again, and it's Victor Fischer here. It's a shame Denmark didn't get through, you know. But then Argentina. Switzerland would have still lost. Carrying on with this pack, we do have Sergio Ramos, defensive rock from Spain. Beautiful card, that is. Lovely. Next up, we do have... And Switzerland have actually got a consolation goal. And it's a lovely card. Game changer card. For Zerdin Shakiri here. The main man. Well, you would say back in the day he was. But yeah, Zerdin Shakiri gets a consolation. It's 4-1. But that will not matter. But at least it's something to cheer about with the fans. If there's still fans there. And be a 4-1 now in this game. Next up, we do have the Mexican of Diego Reyes. Super defender he was. And last not least, we do have... James McLean from Republic of Ireland. And that is the World Cup finish, guys. The World Cup final. And the winners are the World Cup 2020. It is Argentina beating Switzerland 4-1 in this game. So congratulations to Argentina there. So let's see who got top goal scorer in this collection. So Argentina win the World Cup 4-1 against Switzerland in the final. But this World Cup gets even stranger Top goal scorer, three goals. It is the Argentinian defender, Marcus Rojo, with three goals. <laughs> oh my god, what is this, guys? Well, congratulations. He got top goal scorer, the Argentinian, and Argentina won the World Cup. What a World Cup for them. So I hope you enjoyed this World Cup. Please smash the like button, subscribe down below. Let's run it 10 likes if you want me to open another collection and do a World Cup like this. And I will see you guys later. Goodbye.